Becker College holds its inauguration for their 11th president. Dr. Nancy Crimmon has become the first female president in the college's history. Friday, hundreds came to the celebration to show their support. Our Chandler Walsh was there. She joins us live now with the latest. Chandler. Brittany, Becker College is one of the 25 oldest institutions in the country. And even with its hundreds of years of history, Crimin is making history herself as its first official female leader. She has decades worth of experience in education and has been with the school since 2012. Becker students cheer as Dr. Nancy Crimin enters for her inauguration. The Leicester Campus Gymnasium was covered in its school color blue, packed with Crimmins family, colleagues, and hundreds of community members. It really is a point in time where we mark our history and we move forward with a vision. Crimmin, who's already served for a year and a half, is the college's 11th president and the school's first female president. I love the fact that uh, I am the first female president, um, but I'm the first female president who's also just as effective as any other president. This is the real deal. You know, this is a woman who has worked really hard. Lieutenant Governor Karen Polito says it's great to see women doing well in high positions. Nancy is a, a real change agent and uh, someone who came up through the ranks over the past five or six years to the leadership at this college. Students showed support. The women's ice hockey team was among a group wearing inauguration t-shirts. We've had a lot of interest in it, so we've been trying to figure out like where to park, how to get here, what time. We came early because we knew it was going to be busy. Claudia G says Crimin is always supporting them, coming to their games, and they knew they needed to do the same. Right now, especially in hockey, there's a lot of politics going on about women in sport and gender equality. So I think seeing President Crimin being coming and being the full president and being inaugurated today is really good for just like a political change, but also just for her herself. Crimin hopes this milestone is an inspiration to her female students. She's already working to make an impact, launching a strategic plan and adding new majors and programs. We started two new schools, School of Humanities and Social Sciences, and then we rebranded our accelerated division to be the School of Graduate and Professional Studies. So that's just the tip of the iceberg. And the theme of Crimin's inaugural address was leading through authenticity, commitment, and vision. She wants her students to know they come first. Live in Worcester, Chandler Walsh, Worcester News Tonight.